400 T52. Ladies and gentlemen, the victory ceremony for the men's 400 meters T52. Well, this was a terrific race with a great result for the host country. Please welcome the medalists. Sato Tamaki, Raymond Martin of the United States, and Yunabaru Hirokazu to feature. Sato and Martin gave us an incredible finish. 55-39 for Sato, 55-59 for Martin, who was run down with just uh, 20 metres or so to go. Very tactical for a 400 metres it was. Yeah, Sato Tomoki with that last 50 metres when Raymond Martin looked ever set on retaining that Paralympic title from Rio. World record holder, Sato Tomoki. Also the Paralympic record holder now with a time of 55.39. Ian Baru, the 50 years of age. One marathon silver in 2008. 13 years later, at the sprightly age of 50, he's picked up a bronze medal in the men's 400 metres T52 final. Shows you that tenacity does pay off. That's been proven here. by Urambaru. <laughs> Wonderful scenes at his home games. Something he'll cherish for the rest of his life. Raymond Martin. Raymond Martin, it wasn't to be so close to defending that Paralympic gold medal from Rio in 2016. He'll set off a silver though. Quite the athlete. Six Paralympic goals to his name already. Nine World Championship golds. Took a bronze in the 2019 World Championship. Silver in Tokyo. And the man who had won two silver medals at the 2016 Paralympic Games, Sato Tomoki from Okayama. Took up the sport in 2012 after witnessing the London 2012 Games on television. 31 years of age and now a Paralympic champion. So Japan atop the podium. Made his debut in 2015 in Dubai at the World Grand Prix. Six years on, I wonder whether he thought he'd be sitting atop the podium in Tokyo taking a gold medal. He has. And he'll now get a chance to listen to the national anthem of Japan.
Well, there is something uh, moving about hearing the national anthem of the host country. Certainly it was true there for Santo Tamaki and of course Yuanabaru, the gold and bronze medalist split by Aaron Martin of the United States. Seen some great finishes in um, both sessions today, but Sato's performance right up there.